So we anchored up here on the sand flat here, and there's a blue hole right over there. We're gonna go and I'm gonna go swimming. I'm gonna dive in, check out the rudder, the uh, keel, whatnot, make sure they're not damaged too badly. But we finish off this Sierra macro. It was really good. Copped a few pieces of the coconut bread that we got in Bimini. Oh my God, that stuff was good. And I mean, we're gonna anchor out here for the night. And I don't know what else to say. Just enjoy this amazing, amazing piece of land. I don't, I don't even, I don't know what to say. I just have no words. The sand is like, in the water, it's like fluffy. It's like poofy. Unreal. This is, this is beautiful, man. Check this out. Absolutely beautiful. This beach has never been dredged before. Never. Why did you dredge the beach? Huh? Why did you dredge the beach? To replenish it? Because you screwed it up the first time? Yeah. That's what happens. So if you don't screw it up the first time, you don't have to dredge it. Yeah. Coastal engineering at work right there. All right, I guess we're gonna go up for a hike here now. Holy cow, check this out. Literally a path through the jungle here. Holy cow, man. It's like this is actually the jungle, man. Actually the freaking. Hold on, wait for me. Holy cow, dude, this is an actual legitimate hike. I thought it was just a nice meander. No, dude, it's in the middle of the damn forest. Holy cow. Feels like I'm, feels like I'm going to the springs. Kind of walk through the forest to get there. Still have plenty of water on the GoPro screen, but hopefully you guys can see this as clearly as I can. Oh my god, dude. I really don't want to get like ambushed by a snake or something. All I have is freaking fart, fins, mass, circle. That's it. We're here? What's the report there? Oh, here we go. Holy shit. Awesome oh, holy shit. No, I think holy shit's correct. No swimming in that. What in the world? There's no way to get you out. Is there no way to get out? No. Uh, yeah, there is. Is there actually? Uh, people have gotten out of here before. I, dude, that's gonna be a hassle. <laughs> How do we do it? Dude, this is like, what in the world? I wouldn't. Dude, this is insane. Yeah. Dude, I've seen some cool things, but this is, whoa. You guys see me? I can hear you. Hold no, on. I'm not reaching over, looking over that shit. Where you at? Hold on. Where is here? Did you walk, walk down the trail? Yeah. Uh huh. To the rock? There's a lot of rocks. Oh, yeah, the one you just threw? Yeah. Oh, okay, you're right there. Yeah. All right, so I can get up, back up here. Here. At least I can. Well, here. Oh, I see you. I see your hand down there. Can you come down and uh, come get us and show us how to get down there? That's right here. Yeah. Oh. All right. Huh? Well, I want to I want to see what the path is first before I just full send it. You know what I mean? I don't know what's in there, man. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. Oh my god. What in the world this isn't? Took a couple. <sighs> All right, we're going to find a way. We're going to get down there and we're going to go for a swim. All right, well first before we uh before we jump in, we're gonna walk down the path to get back up here. So I know what I'm contending with here. That's a sheer drop. We're going this way. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to hit anything on the way down. Besides water. Oh wow, okay, this actually isn't too bad. Pretty easy. Not bad, not bad. Oh yeah. 
Wow, dude, this is, oh, I almost broke my ankle. Again. Dude, look at this cave. What in the world? You should have brought your fins. I'll bring my friends. Yeah. Wow, dude, this is so cool. Carlton, get down here. Wow, dude, this is incredible. We're filming. Wow, dude, this is so cool. No homeless people in there. <coughs> Looks like people, yeah, people have gone in there. What's that? All right, we're down now. It's now that we know how to get down here, get down here to the water. We're gonna go for a jump. Ready? Yeah, you ready for this? All right, get this on video. Here we go. That's the plan. Right. Looks like I got a nice little ledge I gotta get over. I don't wanna run because I'm gonna break my ankle this All way. Right, we're at Blue Hole in the Bahamas. Jose here is gonna jump in. We're gonna do it. We're doing it. Yeah, you're braver than I am. I'm, in here. I'm actually kinda, oh, I'm thinking about it more. I just gotta full send it. Dude, if it was like a level feel, like a level thing, right, I could. I stopped recording. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm gonna do it. Hey, you're thinking about it too much. Thinking about it. <laughs> All right. I, I gotta record again. <sighs> <sighs> All right, you ready? All right, here we go. Hold on. All right, we're out in uh, the blue hole in the Bahamas, and Jose's gonna jump in. Hoffman's blue hole. Three. Hoffman's blue hole. Hoffman's blue hole. Three, two, one. Yeah! I feel like on top of the world, but yet I'm in the, yet I'm in the water. Oh, dude, this water is warm. <coughs> to watch like freaking megalodon come up and eat me right here. Yeah, you better get out. <sighs> it's not in here, it's just uh, mollusks and. You don't know that. No, I read the thing about the guys that dove. The <laughs> really? How deep is it? I think they said they went down like 80 feet. Okay, it's not terrible. They, um... Dude, I almost want to swim around here. This is cool. Yeah, in the fence, yeah. Right? <sighs> yeah. Let me get to shore here. There's like terraces. It's like layers of drop offs. Yeah. It's crazy. But I don't see any life. Just like algae and snails. Yeah. I wonder how they got in here. Huh? No, it's only algae and snails. All the way down to the bottom. Algae and snails. But how did they get in here? Is this just like an isolated ecosystem that just evolved isolated by itself? That's what I've heard. That's crazy, dude. A lot of these are tidal. So like there will be a big crack. Oh, so then, okay, so they're not isolated then. Well, I don't know. Really? You don't hit it at slack dive. Really? Yeah. That's pretty crazy. That's really only if you're like cave diving. Like if you're diving. Oh, if you're like on the bottom. Yeah. Okay, well. Not really uh, at the bottom, but if you're deep down. Yeah. Like you know, 100 feet down or something. Yeah. Well, up here, it should be fine. It sucks people in. Really? Yeah. Wow. I'm going to do a loop around. Huh? Mm -hmm. I'm going to do a loop around. See, we see how it is, see what it looks like from here on out.
Well, that was a cool little swimmer. Oh, time to go hiking a little bit. <laughs> what? Are you out of the water? I'm coming up right now. Okay. I'm on the, uh, I would say the bank, but uh, more so rocks than anything. So I'm just getting my fins off. Then I'm gonna come up there. What? We're heading back. All right, cool. I'll start walking in a minute here. Unreal. Unreal. Dude, the ocean, it's so much colder here than it was in a hole. Unbelievable. I don't understand why, but I guess that works. This is, I know there's water on the GoPro, hold on. This is, this is insane, man. Look at this There's a boat way out there. Unreal, man. Welcome to the Bahamas, baby. Welcome to Hoffman's Blue Hole uh, and the Berry Islands. Turtle go, dude. That was a little. Oh, he's right there. Oh, I see him. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Little baby sea turtle. I wish we had a fucking bottle of rum and a fire. We're hanging out. The old sea shanties. Just hanging out, man. This yeah, is. What the fuck are gonna drink tonight? You're goddamn right. Water's going too. Oh, yeah. The sand is like so soft. It just like melts under. It's like butter. It melts underneath your feet. It almost sticks to the bottom of my feet, too. It's insane. It's really soft. It's so soft. Look the bottom of my foot. This, 
this is like absolutely beautiful. Huh? Yeah. Oh man, this is this is spectacular. You know the crazy part of this whole trip? I've only caught like a handful of fish. Unfortunately, the GoPro battery died while we were on that island. I only had one GoPro battery with me. I didn't bring the case with the backup because I didn't want it to get wet, salty, etc. Uh, but we spent the rest of the afternoon there taking pictures on Carlton's phone and exploring the island before coming back to the boat for sunset beers and some dinner. And that evening was honestly one of the most memorable evenings, not just of the trip, but frankly of my whole life. You know, where the emotions of the trip really started to hit me. I was doing something that I had only dreamed about and seen in movies growing up. And sitting there with some Jimmy Buffett playing, which I grew up listening to a whole lot while spending my summers in the Keys, which was the closest thing I had at the time to the islands. And with drinks going, I mean, I can say that I genuinely felt bliss. Pure bliss and happiness. Something that I don't think a whole lot of people really get to experience in their lifetimes. And I will never forget the way I felt watching that sunset, just that glowing feeling of happiness. So I hope you genuinely enjoyed watching this portion of the trip. Leave a comment down below if you love the scenery and subscribe with the notifications on so you can tune in to the next videos from this trip. And I'm going to leave you with this little bit right as the sunset finished up. It doesn't get much better than that, man. It really, really doesn't. It really doesn't, man.